Is heart cancer a thing? Every year, the American Cancer Society releases a massive report on new cancer cases, from common cancers like lung and breast to rarer ones like eye cancer. But what about the heart? I mean, can you even get heart cancer? First, quick recap. Cancer starts when the DNA of a cell mutates, and instead of self-destructing when damaged, it keeps on dividing over and over. That's why cancer tends to show up in places where cells divide more often, like the lungs or the colon. More cell divisions mean more chances for DNA mutation, which increases the chance of cancer. But your heart's a bit different. The muscle cells in your heart stop dividing shortly after you're born. So less cell divisions means fewer opportunities for mutation, which means heart cancer is technically possible, but extremely rare. Of all of the tumors found in the heart, 99.3% are from cancers that started somewhere else, like the lungs or the breast. And of the 0.7% that are primary tumors, only 25% are cancerous, and 75% of those are sarcomas, which are cancers of the connective tissue, so not the heart muscles themselves. Between 1973 and 2015, only 442 cases of heart sarcomas were reported in the entire US, so very, very rare. The most important takeaway is that the reason your heart doesn't get cancer is because it doesn't regenerate like other organs do. So once heart cells die, that's it. They're gone for good. That's why things like not smoking, exercising regularly, and managing stress are so important because you only get one heart, so look after it and follow for more medical explainers like these.